Okay, so I'm standing here and it's the sunrise here in Rwanda. We're catching the sunrise and it's just gorgeous behind me. And it's coming up over the over this valley here and over this cordillera and it's lighting up everything. But um, we're here early and we're gonna enjoy this. And today we're gonna go down. We're gonna go down to the to the river and see it. So it should be a spectacular day. That view, folks, right behind me. It's beautiful. Take a look. That's very cool. We're gonna go even further down. We'll take you guys on that trip with us. Awesome. Crazy path, man. The um, wire is down here. The railing is completely gone here. You have to be very, very careful on this path. I don't see too many tourists here. It's a very dangerous one, folks. Stay all the way to this side. In case you did fall, you would go into this. View, but look at this path we just went on, and there's no railing here or anything. We're all the way down to the to the river there. Do not want to go down in that. We'll never come back. But it's an amazing shot of the falls. There's the bridge. Okay, we came down here. We trekked down here, and there's this path. And uh, this is, you know, not the touristic zone. Obviously, this is pretty crazy here. It's maybe a little, a little bit dangerous, but. This is travel at a guy, so you can see this is uh, not really touristic, but we came all the way down here in this path, and it's, it's quite a dangerous path. If you fell off here, you would be dead. You would be dead, there's no question. But it's amazing that you can do these kind of things. In Spain, they still allow you to do stuff like this. I mean, the United States, this would all be roped off, it'd be prohibited. But here you can come down, you can adventure. So if you want to risk your life, they'll let you do it here. But it is a little bit crazy. So this is that magnificent view behind me of the falls. It is really amazing.
Tell them where we're at. We came all the, we're close to the bottom now, right? Yeah, yeah, we're going to the bottom here. Uh, we had to work to get down here. The path just collapsed in at some point. Yeah, and uh, it was uh, completely washed out the path, and um, they've rebuilt some of it. You can see where it was completely washed out this winter. Yeah, but so, still there's some big boulders on the there's path. There's not too many people. Have to jump over. This has some kind of sign on it. What is yeah, this? This is uh, electric, Central Electric, it says, folks. Huh. You can see it's very old, some kind of building here where they used Definitely. maybe the uh, electrical power from the river. This is pretty cool. It's been turned into a bird nest. Careful, there's a oh, be careful there, man. There's a big drop there. Oh, oh, both of these are open. Big drop down in there. I want to fall in there. This looks like something out of Tomb Raider. If you want. Okay, where are we going now? All right, here we're in some sort of that general central electric or something, and we're going down into the like a basement or something. Maybe there was some sort of generator down here. Huh. I don't know what this is. It's careful, not there's not a bear or something in there. So yeah, be careful. You want to explore this. We don't know. Could be anything. Could be somebody living in here. Look at this. Oh man. That's pretty cool. Only on Travel at a Guy channel you see this. You don't see anybody else doing this. There's no other tours down here. Nobody else came down here. Yeah. Uh-huh. Wow. Watch out or something. Looks like a big giant spider there, maybe. It was a big web. Some people been down in here. Some guy painted a naked guy here on the wall. <laughs> this is quite an, quite an exploration today. Abandoned out. Okay, what'd you find, Jordan? All right, we're down that crazy path over there. And we're into some kind of little old house or something. Yeah. This says, Fossil is a descent al infierno. And in, in, Spanish, in English, that means easy is the descent to, the, to hell. Oh, that's really nice. Look at this place. And there's something down in here you can see. I don't know if somebody's in here living here. Or... Venga, empieza a tener. Bueno, deja de que nos veas. Venga. Me da mucho miedo. Me da mucho miedo. Dos y tres. Ah, muy bien. Muy bien. No, 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 gracias. <laughs> Muy bien. Ahora ya es llano, si no tienes que subir por donde has venido. Ya, yeah, ya, yeah, vale. Ahora es llanito ya, ¿eh? Ajá. Uh -huh. Este camino ya es fácil. ¿Tú sabes? ¿Cómo es fácil? Él lo he hecho antes yo. ¿Quieres? ¿Tienes mano? Con, con, con la mano. Espera, espera, espera. Ahora. Una, dos. Yeah, get past the back. Bien, bien. Muy bien, chicos. Bien. Gracias, amigo. Muy bien. promised you some amazing shots and we have not failed to deliver. Look at this behind me. This is just amazing. Call me down here, it's really an experience.
Look at these guys behind you. They're coming up the... <laughs> We're looking here and they're coming up the uh, the cliff. Oh, okay, go ahead. <laughs> y tú es... Tú es subido de la... de la río. Oh, oh madre mía. Y no, y no, y no tiene miedo. Oh, madre mía. Oh, muy bien. <laughs> Viene más gente, más locos. <laughs> a tú, es tu primera vez. Mi primera vez, la verdad. Ah, ¿y qué? Miedo. Un poco, poco miedo. Fuerza en los brazos. Ah, no seguro. Oh, tía, se me ha la oh, mira. Muy bien, muy bien. Oh, oh impresionante. ¿De dónde soy? Uh, yo soy de Estados Unidos. People aren't scared here. Okay, you can see we just came down this uh, really wild path and I've caught it here on, on camera and it's, uh, we started all the way at the top of that bridge and we came down, we came down and there's a lookout point and most people stopped there. No, we, we kept going, we kept going. You're with the Travelatic guy and Jordan and I, we were adventurous. We went down, we saw that hydroelectric plant that's uh, like abandoned there. We saw that and we met this other couple, this Spanish couple and I really give them credit. The man was middle-aged and his wife and uh, they were doing uh, doing pretty well and they were coming down this path and uh, we got to one point that we looked like we couldn't cross and uh, the guy there's just a stick there separating it there was no bridge anything and uh, I didn't want to go any further and uh, I said let's go back and the man said no no I can jump and his wife thought he was crazy and he jumped and he he landed right on that little path there and uh, you know if you had fallen either way it would have been it would have been a, a problem you would have probably broken your leg or the other side was really disastrous so uh, the wife did not want to go. She did not want to jump. So finally he told her give me your hand and he jumped and we saw that she did it and we were going to go back and because I had my equipment with me too. I'm filming and uh, he said uh, you know you can you can make it too. So we helped each other and we, we got across there so and uh, I filmed it all but uh, it was quite interesting. So you can see the path was pretty pretty treacherous and there's another path going down. We could have took this easy route but no we had to take the most difficult one. So we're almost at the bottom now. You can go a little further down. So we're going to see if we can continue going now. We're up, we're up out of that uh, that wilderness and all that. But uh, it was quite an interesting uh, adventure today. I'm glad you could come along with us. Travel at it, guy. <laughs>